This first experiment is a single replacement reaction in which copper from the solid metal strip will replace silver ions in the solution of silver nitrate. As the reaction progresses, the solution will slowly change from clear to clear blue. This color change will take a few minutes to become noticeable. Keep a keen eye out for this color change. We will also be able to see silver form on the copper strip. Here we begin to see the evidence of silver precipitating out of solution by the formation of silver metal on the copper strip. The color change from clear to blue is not yet evident. The blue color of the solution is indicative of the formation of copper nitrate solution. This color change is due to the copper two ions dissociated in solution. The solution will become more blue in color as more silver ions are removed from the silver nitrate solution and replaced by the copper two ions to form copper two nitrate. Now the silver precipitate can easily be observed as a thick layer on the copper strip. Also note the silver precipitate that has slept off the copper strip and settled out on the bottom of the solution. The blue color of the solution is becoming more observable. On the activity series of metals, copper is above silver, which means copper will replace silver in the silver nitrate solution. This is why silver forms a precipitate and why a new solution of copper nitrate forms. Here is another example of a single replacement reaction. Hydrochloric acid reacts with solid zinc metal to form hydrogen gas and a solution of zinc chloride. Hydrogen is lower on the activity series of metals, so zinc will replace hydrogen on hydrochloric acid. A wood splint test will support that the gas bubbles being released are hydrogen. When the solutions of lead 2 nitrate and potassium iodide are mixed, the metal cations exchange with the nonmetal anions to form a solution of potassium nitrate and an insoluble yellow precipitate of lead 2 iodide. In this double replacement reaction, a solution of sodium phosphate is added to a solution of lead 2 nitrate. The aqueous metal cations exchange nonmetal anions. In this case, the lead 2 cation abandons nitrate and rejoins with phosphate to form the white precipitate lead 2 phosphate. Sodium abandons phosphate and rejoins with nitrate to form a new solution of sodium nitrate. In this reaction, the decomposition of hydrogen peroxide, or H2O2, is sped up dramatically when the catalyst MnO2, or manganese dioxide, is added to the hydrogen peroxide. The hydrogen peroxide decomposes into water and oxygen gas. Evidence that the gas bubbles evolved in this reaction are oxygen is that a glowing wood splint bursts back into flames when it contacts the oxygen that is concentrated on the inside of the test tube. In this combustion reaction, a fine powder made of hydrocarbons is dispersed into the air where it mixes with oxygen. In the flame, the combustion reaction proceeds to form CO2 and water. Note the great release of energy. 